Here at the Computer Science and Artificial Intelligence Laboratory at MIT, we've developed a manned portable mapping system which enables uh, exploration in GPS-denied buildings and indoor areas, allowing the user to build maps in real time as they explore their environment. The device worn by the user contains onboard processing in a backpack, a connect depth sensor, an inertial sensor, and a ranging LiDAR, or laser rangefinder. As the user explores, his motion is determined using incremental LiDAR scan matching. The LiDAR sweeps a laser beam around in a 270 degree arc and measures the time it takes for the light pulses to return. Reprojecting the LiDAR scans produces this continually expanding map. However, motion drift will gradually cause errors in the map. Errors can be rejected when the user returns to a location that has been previously observed. In addition, it is important that these scans be corrected for the user's gait. This is done using the inertial sensor. The entire process is real-time, while the necessary computation is carried out on the explorer's backpack. Meanwhile, the camera system collects snapshots, which you can see in the bottom right. It's these images that users to detect a previously visited location. During larger excursions, significant drift can occur. These can visibly corrupt the map, for example, obscuring doorways or explore unexplored areas. When a previously visited location is determined, map smoothing can resolve this inconsistency. Using a clicker, the user can inject tags into the map, labeling important or interesting locations. In future, we hope to annotate the map with higher level information, such as spoken directions or detected signage. What you don't see in this video is that the device also supports multi-floor mapping by detecting operation in staircases and elevators using the inertial sensor and a barometer. These maps can be transmitted wirelessly in real time back to a remote base station. The goal of this project is to enable situational awareness by the user or an external commander in search and rescue operations.